for being so patient and going through the experiment with me. Of course, that's what friends are for. Are we just friends? I think I want to be more than friends. So, Gug, <coughs> uh, what are you doing today? You're looking nice. Oh, I can't say that. That's so weird. So, Doug, what a fine day it is outside, isn't it? Ah, oh, that sounds so lame. Hey, Evie, what are you doing? Oh, Mal, you scared me. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to. I called your name a couple of times, but you were so deep into what you were doing. Are you rehearsing for a play or something? Not exactly. Do you think a girl should be able to ask a boy out? Of course! It's 2016! Why, Evie? Who are you asking out? Uh, me? No, I never said it was me. I mean, it's just a theoretical question for, for, for a friend, you, you know? Who's interested in someone, but you, you know, just theoretical. Uh, did I say that already? Oh, well, tell your friend to just be forward and ask. I mean, what's the point in wondering whether the guy is interested or not? Mal's right. According to Doug's dad, Doug came here to sign out some books. Oh, there he is. Oh my gosh, what do I say? I'm so nervous. <coughs> oh, hi Doug. <laughs> Fancy running into you here. Uh, I was just looking at a book for, uh, you know, how to make uh, jewelry. No, uh, no, I didn't ask your dad or anything. Jeez, I don't want him to think I'm stalking him or something. Uh... Hi, Doug. Uh, I didn't know you liked the library. Ah, uh, that sounds silly. Of course he likes the library. He's so smart and he loves to read. Ah. Uh. Oh, hi, Evie. Oh, Doug, you scared me. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I didn't think I would run into you here. Oh, yeah. I was looking for a book on uh, cooking. Oh no, the story was jewelry. I, I mean, uh... Are you alright? You seem a bit nervous. Uh, yeah, uh, well, maybe, uh, maybe I had too much coffee this morning, you know? So, um, since you're here, not that I'm stalking you or anything, because I'm definitely not, um, I wanted to say thank you to you for helping me with all the lab work this past year. Oh, it was my pleasure. You were such a great lab partner. Still, I thought maybe I could treat you to dinner or something to say thanks. Oh, that's not necessary. I was happy to do it. No, but wait, this is not a how I practiced it. Practiced? Oh, I mean, uh, uh... Evie, get yourself together and be brave! Uh, I'm just gonna say it. Doug, I like you. I was wondering if you would be interested in having dinner with me. Not just to say thank you, but as a date. A date? Wow, Evie, I, I'm so flattered. I would love that. Evie? Needless to say, I fainted from all the nerves and at the worst time too, just when Doug said yes to my date. But he understood. In fact, he was pretty nervous himself on our first date. I can't wait for our second. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more.